Hey guys, it's Zareej, and I'm back with another video. <laughs> so this one is also a kind of unique metaphor, I would say, but I will see if you guys agree. So, what happens when you buy a new phone? You walk out of that Verizon store and you, you know, bought that new phone. You're so protective of it, like true or not true, especially with me. I'm not going to even be a hypocrite. I'm so protective when I get a new phone, right? Isn't anyone like they wash their hands before they like, you know, use it. They buy that screen protector. They buy a case. They try to cover it up, you know, to so make sure there's not, you know, like scratches or anything. So let's say one day you are walking, right? And you accidentally drop the phone and you're like, oh my God, I dropped the phone. What the heck? And once you pick it up, there's like a crack there, right? And now you're like, oh, damn it. So you like, you know, it's, you know, there's some phones, I don't know, but like it goes past the screen protector and stuff. But usually when my phone cracks and stuff, like the whole screen's cracked or whatever. Anyway, so you get that first crack, right? So basically, this is a metaphor for relationships. And that first crack is that first fight. So the honeymoon phase is over, that first fight hits, and it's pretty ugly. I think the first fights are really ugly because you get to see how this person is angry you see their true emotions they you see how stressed and angry they are and how because some people they stay calm when they're angry but sometimes some people they lash out and stuff so like that first crack is that first fight so when you fast forward and you have that crack you're not as protective of the phone as you used to be right you are still you're like eh, it's, it's there's a crack now like i there's kind of no point in taking care of it as like i used to you sort of get kind of careless with the phone since you know it's not as perfect as it used to be so that's basically saying like oh now i've seen how this person really is when it gets that you know intimate and angry and you know how like the there's so much tension in the air right so you see them in a different way that you usually don't see them right so when you fast forward there's gonna be a couple of, you know, more cracks on the phone. You know, there's like, it's not, imagine a broken iPhone. Yeah, this, I was thinking this the whole day. Imagine a broken iPhone. Usually when you see some people, their iPhones are completely shattered. That's gonna be the more fights growing into the relationship. And sometimes they're really useless fights. They're not even that, you know, like, doesn't even make sense. Like when you look back at it, you're gonna be like, why did we even fight over this? But yeah, that's basically like a bunch of cracks. And the worst part of this is that the person looks for someone new and it could be cheating or anything but you know once you get like a phone that has a bunch of cracks you go buy a new phone basically that's the breakup because other people have different responsibilities and the relationship isn't as it used to be basically when you see a phone that has a bunch of cracks in it it's you don't take care of it as when you used to first take care of it when you bought that new phone right so now you buy a new phone and you take and the cycle starts all over again. You get the new phone, basically you get into a different relationship, you see the first fights, there are gonna be a couple of cracks. Those cracks represent different fights in a relationship. And sometimes people end them based on different responsibilities, or sometimes people basically as you know, as humans, we don't look past those fights or we don't look past those cracks you know how we see a person and we see how they are in situations that are not perfect and we can't look past the thing that oh this is the person that I you know went for like now I understand why I had a connection with that person <laughs> get it connection and then there's like a phone connection <laughs> I'm sorry <laughs> basically you've lost that connection you know and you can't look past those cracks to see, oh, that's the phone that I first bought. Like, there's nothing different about it except looking at it from a different point of view. Basically, when you buy that new phone, it's going to have cracks and then you're going to buy a new one. And as humans, we don't look past those cracks. But basically, and, you know, at the end of this, you should look past those, you know, problems those different emotions you see in a person when it comes to you know different situations you need to look past those because you might end up you know getting you know married or something or you could realize that you have more in common than you do 
I understand no one's perfect, but you have to, you know, respect those imperfections because people react in different ways. So, moral of this is keep your broken phone. <laughs> Not really, but I just use the phone as a metaphor to say, you know, in relationships, you really need to look past all those imperfections and you know have to realize why you fell for this person in the first place you know so hope you guys like this video and if you have any other advice that you would like to share just you know my social medias are down below so bye guys